Ethereum ETH to $20,000. Kathy Wood reveals ETH secret. Ethereum price prediction. Three of the largest holders of Grayscale Ethereum Trust, ETHE, added to or held their positions steady. New filings to the SEC show. Kathy Wood's ARK Investment Management added 82,867 shares of ETHE, bringing its total to more than 721,000, according to its latest SEC 13F filing. Hardly surprising given Wood's overall bullishness on ETH. Today we are going to talk all about what Kathy Wood revealed about ETH. So watch this video till the end because today's video is going to be a bomb. Welcome to Cryptoland, your daily dose of crypto. If you're interested in everything around crypto, this is the place for you. Subscribe if you want to stay updated with all the crypto news, predictions, and stay one step ahead in the crypto world. Make sure to hit the like button for us to provide you with more crypto news. Don't forget to enable all notifications to join our weekly cash giveaway pinned in the comments. Before we get to our topic, let's take a look at the chart and see what the price of ETH is doing on the 4th of September, shall we? Ethereum penetrated the consolidation pattern this week, which was in play since mid-August, when the coin failed to break resistance at $3,350. This resulted in it forming a symmetrical triangle pattern for the second half of August and gaining about 17% in a week. ETH bounced from the 20-day MA and broke above the symmetrical triangle. It then continued to break the August resistance at $3,350 to climb above $3,400. It went higher yesterday as it surged from $3,400 to reach higher, $3,825. It has since dropped from the high and is trading around $3,765. Looking ahead, if the bulls break $3,825, the first resistance lies at $4,000. This is followed by $4,060, $4,200, $4,280, and $4,400. On the other side, the first support lies at $3,640. This is followed by $3,510, $3,400, and $3,300. The RSI is now also rising as the bullish momentum increases. Now let's get back to the topic. ARK holds 721,936 shares of the Grayscale Ethereum Trust, valued at $20.91 million. The investment management firm also holds 8.67 million shares of Grayscale's Bitcoin Trust, valued at nearly $298.07 million. While ARK's exposure to the Bitcoin Trust is higher than the Ethereum Trust, the year-to-date returns of the latter have been more impressive. ARK Investment Management CEO Kathy Wood has declared her support for Ethereum and its vast decentralized finance ecosystem in her recent tweet. Her bullishness is not limited to her Twitter handle. ARK owned 721,936 shares of Grayscale Ethereum Trust that were cumulatively worth $20 million, according to its latest filing with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission. As we all know, Ethereum is more than just digital money. It's also an open source blockchain for conducting transactions, referred to as a decentralized digital applications, dApps, or smart contracts. Smart contracts are 100% secure, require no third-party intermediary, and can codify, decentralize, and trade just about anything. All of this requires power and energy, so to cover the cost, the Ethereum network creates tokens called Ether. This is the fuel that powers smart contracts. Ether is also the cryptocurrency that you can buy, sell, or trade. A smart contract could be as simple as selling a second-hand bicycle or setting up a fundraising initiative without going through a crowdfunding site. Alternatively, smart contracts could facilitate complex financial agreements, including credit approvals, property purchases, insurance premiums, and much more. In other words, smart contracts could automate extremely complex transactions in a way that is fast, secure, and completely transparent. Agreements that now take days and weeks to finalize could happen in a matter of minutes, or maybe even instantaneously. And this is only the tip of the iceberg. Ethereum's secure blockchain technology could make online voting a real possibility, ushering in a new age of democratic engagement and representation. It could also revolutionize the healthcare and legal industries, logistics, telecommunications, streaming services, education, social media, and e-commerce. Ethereum's biggest fans think this blockchain technology will form the basis of an entirely new internet 
or what experts are calling Web 3.0. In theory, the new web would be completely decentralized, giving users a chance to take back control of their information and create an organic online identity. This user-centric approach would incentivize the creation of networks where people and companies develop products and services that benefit everyone. It would also put an end to some of the more problematic big tech practices we see today, including data mining, censoring particular political views, and manipulating user experience to create more addictive platforms. To look at this another way, Web 2.0 treats users as consumers or units. Web 3.0 would enable users to be individuals. As you can see, much of Ethereum's value comes from its future applications, but will all this potential turn into a reality? Well, many people certainly think so. Ethereum has received public backing from some major players in the financial and tech spheres. The Enterprise Ethereum Alliance, EEA, is a global community of more than 140 blockchain leaders, adopters, innovators, developers, and businesses from around the globe. Some of its most prestigious members include investment giant JP Morgan, Santander Bank, and British Petroleum, BP, as well as tech giants Microsoft and Intel. The EEA helps promote the benefits of blockchain technology. It's also working on building business-ready versions of the Ethereum software. Ms. Wood, who publicly shares her trades daily at the end of each session, is one of the cryptocurrency's most bullish fund managers. She's repeatedly said publicly that Bitcoin will eventually reach half a million dollars apiece, and the cryptocurrency is the seventh biggest position in her next generation ETF. The bet is emblematic of Ms. Wood's brash approach to investing. While most traditional Wall Street fund managers have largely avoided the volatile cryptocurrencies, Ms. Wood has become one of its most public backers. Her Bitcoin price call is premised on institutions and companies allocating as much as 5% of their cash to the cryptocurrency. But firms remain a long way off from broad adoption of Bitcoin and ETH. Square Inc. and MicroStrategy Inc. are among companies that have crypto allocations. Suffice to say, the altcoin doesn't quite have the high-profile backing that Bitcoin does. But there are still plenty of voices of support out there. Managing partner at Blocktown Capital, James Todaro, is overwhelmingly bullish on ETH, believing it will reach a staggering $9,000 before the end of 2021. Mr. Todaro's prediction was echoed by Simon Dedick, the co-founder of Blockfire, who also believes Ethereum has the potential to reach $9,000. However, he did not speculate when this price point might be reached. Kathy Wood also appreciated the ETH blockchain, which is a big thing. Now let's talk about the price prediction of ETH till 2025. So what will Ethereum be worth in 2025? Digital Coin predicts that by 2025, Ethereum could almost triple its current value to $12,807.83. The Economy Forecast Agency predicts a huge increase of Ethereum's price. They believe Ethereum could reach $25,626 by April 2025, but this is not the highest predicted price during this interval. The highest price of Ethereum predicted by the Economy Forecast Agency could be roughly $26,138 and might be reached by August 2022. Trading Beasts estimates a relatively lower and steadier increase in Ethereum's price averaging around $13,400 by the end of 2024 and the beginning of 2025. Cryptocurrency price prediction expects the price of Ethereum to brush against a staggering $50,000 by the end of December 2025. Based on these predictions, we can assume that the value of Ethereum might still be below $30,000 halfway through the decade. While the price of Ethereum may increase rapidly in the future, Ethereum as a platform is predicted to grow far larger than it is now. As the first platform to offer decentralized services besides transactions, more businesses are becoming reliant on Ethereum because it's quicker, safer, cheaper, and more easily accessed. As the number of dApps, decentralized apps, increases daily, it indicates that Ethereum is likely growing as well. Furthermore, when the upgrade of Ethereum 2.0 is fully completed, both the use of Ethereum network and the value of Ether ETH might increase. Well, that's it for today's video, guys. Also, we would like to mention that this is not a channel intended specifically to provide financial advice, and we do not ask you to invest in any company. This is merely a channel directed towards bringing educational content to your doorsteps. 
With that in mind, before you invest in anything, we recommend you do thorough, wide-spectrum research on the topic. And make sure to subscribe and give us a thumbs up. See you next time on Cryptoland.